if you look at the history of Google over the years, I mean, we've always tried to create a successful ecosystem, successful partnerships. Uh, it started in the early days with Search, where we had a lot of partnerships around Search, and, and still uh, Search, um, in combination with AdWords, is really powering the economic growth for I don't know how many, like, can't say the exact number, but for millions of small and medium-sized businesses across the world. So that's a huge part of our partnership ecosystem. So first, I'm deeply aware of the concerns that, that publishers have, and, and we're taking them very, very seriously. Uh, we, we are not a media company. We don't want to be a media company. We still define ourselves as a technology company, um, and we're really working very hard at the moment. And I, I have to admit, um, uh, having watched this over the years now at Google, um, we haven't always been good at bringing this across, that we actually have a very keen interest in partnering with media companies, um, and we're trying to create ecosystems together with media companies that helps, them, that helps them in the transition to the digital world. Because frankly, the challenge is the same for all of us. Uh, consumers are adopting new technologies at a rate and at a speed like I've never, ever seen before. There's no doubt that what is happening in the world of artificial intelligence or machine learning, how we mostly refer to it, um, is, is one of the big revolutions of our time and will stay with us uh, for, for many, many decades to come. Um, and is probably the next real big computing paradigm in the world. Um, and it's something we're investing heavily into. It's something we need to understand. I'm deeply aware of the privacy sensitivities, um, especially here in Europe. Uh, I, I, can, I can understand it. I mean, obviously, I am I'm German, right? I grew up in this world. And there are a lot of good reasons why we have those sensitivities. And I think we need to actually be, um, be cognizant of them. We cannot slow down um, innovation and technology simply because of the fear of privacy and something crazy that could happen. But we really need to be aware of the, of, of the implications and how we can, and I feel the best solutions to it is in the end creating transparency and control. Uh, control is actually the really important part, right? You need to know what is being done on the privacy side and you need to have control to say, I don't want it.